Well, I'm delighted to be at Carrick Green Grocers today because I believe it's an excellent example of a grassroots community-based initiative. Earlier this year, under the National Lottery Awards for All scheme, we awarded the group £4,100. And what they've been able to do is to set up this community-owned, shareholder-owned green grocery shop as part of the wider regeneration of Carrick Fergus. The idea for the Green Grocers came about through a project that we were running in Positive Carrick Fergus. We asked people what their wildest dreams were for Carrick Fergus and what people told us was they wanted to see more shops in the town centre. So here we are. National Lottery Awards for All helped us set up Carrick Green Grocers by helping us develop our branding, our website and to run really vital events to invite people to become shareholders in this first community owned Green Grocers in Carrick Fergus. So following a period of extensive consultation, we published our new strategy. It starts with community. That sets out our grant making priorities from now until the end of the decade. So from the 15th of November, the National Lottery Awards for All scheme will be changing significantly, whereby local groups will be able to apply for up to a maximum of £20,000, and that can be expended over a period of two years. Groups that are currently holding a National Lottery Awards for All grant can't apply until the current grant is exhausted. And importantly, groups thinking about a plan should work with their local communities to ensure the grant can have its greatest impact because a group can only hold one grant at any given time. So our top tip for any groups thinking of a plan to National Lottery Awards for All would be to apply for what you need and develop your idea with your community so that you know it will work.